Oh my God, I still have to put the press-ons on my nails, y'all. This is honestly ridiculous. Hey street team, welcome back to Denny TV where we bring what's going on in these streets to your TV. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Danielle, so make sure that you guys like, comment, and subscribe because y'all know we're about to go up. Hosting my very first event in my apartment with my friends. I'm having a little pool party. So I was just sitting on my couch watching Still and Sunset and my friend was like, uh, where are y'all at? Because I'm at the pool and nobody's here. And I'm like, oh. Let me hurry up and put my swimsuit on and get to the pool. So I'm about to pack some stuff up and then we're about to go to the pool. Everybody brought something. We got, we're going to have chicken, um, barbecue, some hot dogs. We got fruit, drinks, potato salad, everything. And then it's kind of like a 90s theme. I got like some little decorations. I honestly should have bought the decorations early, but I did it last minute. So I got what I got, but whatever. So let me hurry up and get down to the pool because my friend is waiting. There's so many ways to get paid. I tried to but he begged me to stay. Babe, I'm not staying, I just wanna play. In the party, he just wanna run. Big boobs in the bus, they plump. She a baddie, she knows she a 10. She a baddie with her baddie friend. They like, I tell you always stay hot. Or they mad cause I keep making bops. Or she mad cause I'm taking her spot. If I was bitches, I'd hate me a lot. Like damn, she in her mood. 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 Camille's on the decor. <laughs> we are getting into playing games y'all and i said i re i wish that we had carisha please game so somebody is about to look it up on what quiz what what's on it you saw the interview that one might be too new that one might be too i'm sorry that interview was garbage i did not like i mean i'm I, ain't gonna, I don't, see I don't know. Here, I didn't like it. It might be too well, Not saying it on Carisha part because yeah. I liked Carisha, but I felt like I feel Summer like questions was, also all was being, place. I don't Ooh. know. Like when she said, oh, I don't do this for my fans. Show. It's like, well, what? Yeah, uh, she didn't want Carisha please, but I feel like I feel like Miami questions was all over the place. Yeah. They were, but I Maybe I'm like just a also. Miami stan. <laughs> I am a stan, y'all. How to end up getting Summer to spill about the London situation? Yeah. Because at first she was like, Definitely you know what happened to you in London, up. and Summer didn't really say nothing. Mm -hmm. And then after a while, she kept asking questions, and then London ended up. I mean, Summer ended up being like, oh, he was still fucking with his baby mamas. You know, she we already yeah. knew, mm -hmm. but. Uh, I feel like I feel like she did a good job. Please. I mean, I, people I love, uploading it on TikTok, we're gonna have to get the questions out. This is getting real ghetto. I'm, I'm <laughs> getting, it might be too new for No, I ain't giving up. I ain't giving <laughs> up. Okay, let me see. Somebody I'm got a question. All right, let me That's see what that question is. Yeah. I'm All right, I'm somebody volunteer. I'll do it. Whatever. Okay, <laughs> look, my no hands, take a shot using your mouth only. Oh. <laughs> All right, come on. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I know. Let me get another one. We still got the little like, shot. It's like, yeah, she getting a little. These questions are a little. Oh, wow. That's not bad. Brittany talking about that's not bad. She's here. Go, Brit. Go, Brit. Go, Brit. Go, Brit. Go, Brit. I don't think nobody going to take a shot to this, but if they do, I promise I won't judge you. Call it out. All right, take a shot if you ever mess with the ninja and his son. Oh my god. Oh. I mess with men with kids, child. <laughs> <laughs> I bleep the word out. Yes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, cause you vlogging? Yeah. 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 Okay, this is a good, this is a they really good one. Flavor. And it's gonna be fun. So who want it? I'll, it's gonna I'll, be fun. All right. Hey, 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 go hey, pick Lexi. Go it's gonna be fun. Lexi, okay. This is a wild card. Oh. Get up, go outside, and race the person to your right. Loser takes two <laughs> shots. Get set. Go! Whoever loses, they gotta take two shots. Oh, Brittany. What? Girl, you get me shaky face right now. I know, because I hate this, but it's only for 
<laughs> Lexi eating no cap. Yeah, right. <laughs> She's so still. Lay down. Lexi got the upside. I know. <laughs> Somebody just. <laughs> Bro, this is good. They both athletic though, yeah. so I don't know. I'm rooting for both of y'all. Right. <laughs> Somebody drop. I dare you to pimp slap the person next to you right now or take three shots. I ain't gonna pimp slap you hard. Well, you taking three shots. You are foul. She said it's not gonna be that bad. Yeah, she said it's not gonna be that bad. I'm just saying, 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 I
you know, I'm just going to let somebody operate on me and I don't know nothing. So I've been doing research because I need to see if people have lawsuits against them. Um, and I overall want to see your work. So somebody had told me, you know, that they went to this person and I'm looking on the website and they're only showing like one doctor and not the doctor who work I want to see. And then I found this lady that was rated like supposedly, allegedly the best person, you know, and baby, them reviews, it's not adding up. And the thing is, I'm getting this done because I don't want to have the back pain. And like I told y'all, I'm tired of suffering, but I'm also not about to be looking crazy underneath my shirt. Okay. Because I got to look at this. Like I got to be giving 10, you know, from the face and on down. And it's like, I thought about it. Sis, when are you going to be getting this done? Because baby, I like to be outside. I like to be out networking. I like to be at events. I'm not just somebody that likes to sit in the house. So I'm thinking that I'm going to have to get this done in the winter time because we trying to be outside, baby. Like we ain't got to have, we ain't got time for that. This got to be done before my birthday because I got to pop out new body who this, okay? Back pain gone. I got to wear some, you know, cut up on my birthday. Um, and baby, I got to be outside. So we got a lot of stuff to think about. Um, happy Tuesday. I am on the road on my way to work. So if you on this highway, get out of my way because I'm in a hurry. I should have. Oh, is this the police? Yeah, I think this. Oh, that's the police. Okay. Stop speeding, girl. I don't know. Nah, that's not the police. But they car. I don't know. That may be an undercover. Because they car looked like a police car and it got the stuff on the front. I don't know. Okay. Anyway, um, on my way to work and I'm in a hurry because I left the house too late. But I did not go to the gym today, y'all. Today's Tuesday. Did not go to the gym. Did not go to the gym Monday. I am doing bad. But, like, this is realistic. It's so hard to get back in the gym when you've, like, stopped going. And I was really enjoying cycling until them people had pissed me off. And sometimes I'd be like, I wish they didn't piss me off because I enjoyed it. But anyway, we're not going to talk about that. I am aiming to go back to the gym soon. But um, I'm really excited because I am going to QCP um, Peace Ball. If you guys are not familiar with who that is, um, that is, you know, the owner of, you know, City Girls and Lil Baby's label, um, black owned business. They recently like merged with somebody. I don't know too much about that that's old news but anyway this is like a huge deal last year and i believe the year before last because this is the third annual black ball i remember like when i seen everybody on instagram looking oh so beautiful and all that i was like oh my god i want to go to the black ball and literally like last year i said that and what the hell i am going y'all i'm going to the black ball so i'm really really excited Honestly, Atlanta is going to be on fire Thursday because um, Future is going to be getting honored at the Trap Museum and they're unveiling um, his monument um, that, you know, at the Trap Museum, his new exhibit. So I think that would be cool if I was going to try to like go to both events, but the doors at the black ball open at eight and that's really gonna shut the city down so i don't need to be playing because if i don't get over there in time i'm not gonna end up getting in um because it's gonna be so many people going so i gotta you know ultimately choose the black ball and i'll catch future another time like i've seen future in concert and i'm possibly going home to see him in concert so we'll catch future um is my camera about to die i think my camera's about to die as y'all can see i'm in the car and y'all already know where i'm about to go today is gonna be such a huge day in atlanta i gotta show y'all my outfit so i wanted to wear this one dress but 
I didn't end up ordering it because of the way my boobs are and I just felt like it wasn't gonna look right it was so so far so far so I ended up ordering another dress um and I like the dress but it has this silver like thing at the bottom to kind of hold the dress in place and make it flare and it has like a long split so like depending on how I'm walking it kind of flips back and it shows and I don't like that because I don't want that showing but also like it's the day of I just got my outfit yesterday so I highly doubt that I'm gonna be able to find an outfit today you know like you have to order stuff online but overall i'm like i'm not about to just be so dramatic and complain i know i'm gonna look good i feel good we got the hair touched up okay um i'm on my way to get my makeup done i'm so excited to get my makeup done because i just know it's going to look so good and i'm gonna be looking you know really good and top tier um and plus like when your skin just gives all the time when you put the makeup on a little extra you know you look good so i'm excited um i feel like it'll all just work out so things to do today go get our makeup done after that i need to go get um a polish change on my toes and then get some press ons to put on my nails hey y'all i just got done getting my makeup done i really really like it it looks so cute and so natural and the makeup artist was really nice and sweet um definitely will be networking and going back to him i just love the look like it's giving model it's giving glam it's giving sis about to step and it's getting ready for the night i look so cute but anyway i'm about to go in the nail shop because i need to get a polish change i'm running a little late on time still have to go to the mall and get a little necklace um a little clutch and then after that you know head on my merry way so let me hurry up and get in this nail shop and get this polish change on my toes so we can get the rest of the day moving forward. Hey guys, we got our toes done. I was literally hollering because I'm cheap and I'm not paying for no gel. So I got regular polish and the girl was so pretty and she was like, she was so cute she was like it take a long time and i'm like girl i don't care how long it's gonna take but after that i'm gonna have to go ahead and switch to gel because it took a long time so i am trying to go to the beauty supply because i need like a little cute simple silver necklace so i tried to go to one beauty supply oh my god like how cute am i i'm so freaking cute anyway I just can't help but say it because I'm looking at myself on like the viewfinder and I'm like, girl, it's giving. Um, I forgot what I was about to say. Oh, okay. Looking for beauty supply. And I drove to one beauty supply and I couldn't find it. And then I'm literally driving around the parking lot where Southern Fire Kitchen is at. And Southern Fire Kitchen or Southern Fire Chicken? I think it's Southern Fire Kitchen. And I couldn't find the beauty supply, but I just found the beauty supply. But anyway, I wonder, are they open? Because I can go for a good meal. Big Mama haven't ate all day. She been driving around trying to get her stuff together. And she has not ate. You know I'm busy if I haven't ate. It's 3.15, y'all. I'm kind of nervous a little bit. Because I'm going by myself. And I know y'all probably like, girl, you go to stuff by yourself all the time. But I just feel like this is something totally like, this is just something totally different. And I need to get the nervousness out of my system. I need to remove it, but I'm really excited. I think it's gonna be fun. Um, I need to just have a good time and kind of get work mode out of my brain. Because every time I go somewhere, I feel like I need to be in work mode. And I don't need to be in work mode today. I just need to have fun, network, 
make connections, but most importantly, have fun. But it's just like when you want something so bad, you can't help but to be in work mode. But I need to chill out. Stop being dramatic, okay? Yeah, so anyway, let's go in this beauty supply because I literally do not have time to waste. And I gotta just get stuff going. It is later on in the day and I'm trying to hurry up and run through my hair really quickly because I'm running late and I'm nowhere... I'm running late, y'all. The time that I had planned to get there, nowhere near the time. So I'm trying to hurry up, make sure the hair is straight and laid because this heat outside was mad crazy. And then just put my necklace on, spray my little scent, and head on out the door because I don't know what kind of line I'm going to be battling. I am on a 24 hour champagne diet. Spilling while I'm sipping. I encourage you to try it. I'm probably just saying that because I don't have to buy it. The club owner supply it. Boy, I'm on that fly shit. I am with everybody in my past. Don't want me to be. Guess what? I made it. I'm the motherfucking man. I just want you to see. Come take a look. It pretty was a person. <laughs> Oh, I look so cute. Oh my God, I still have to put the press-ons on my nails, y'all. This is honestly ridiculous. Okay, I will talk to y'all when I get in the car because this is, this is ridiculous. Get a load of this nigga. It is 8.30 and the line is long, of course. So it's like, sis, you definitely should have got here earlier. I'm on my Disney shit, goofy flow. On records, I'm Captain Hook and my new car is Rufio. Damn, where my roof just go? I'm somebody that you should know. Get to shaking something, cause that's what drama produced it for. I just got home it's been a minute since i actually talked to y'all today is monday i'm about to make dinner really quick i got this meal from publix that i'm literally obsessed with it's like stuffed salmon with broccoli all that you have to do is put your little seasoning on it and then put it in the oven for like 30 minutes and then you have your whole dinner baby like i'm really obsessed with this and i haven't had it in two weeks so i decided to go get it 
gonna put some Tony's Creole on it, but I wanted to update y'all because I haven't talked to y'all since um, the black ball. And when I say sis had a ball, I had such a good time, y'all. Like it felt so good to just be out um, with like, you know, young professional, older professionals. Um, it was just hella inspiring for sure. Like to be around, you know, millionaires, billionaires, or whatever the case may be, like wealthy black people. It was so inspiring. Definitely manifesting it for myself and my family, okay? But it felt so good. I had such a good time and I had so much fun. I literally had so much fun, y'all. Like, I thought that I had just turned 21 again, okay? Like, that's how much fun I had. Um, I was kind of beating myself up a little bit because I didn't, like, go around like I usually would and try to, like, you know, put myself out there and ask people questions. But I feel like that definitely was not the place to be doing that. And you got to know time and place. Um, and everybody was just partying and having, like, a good time. I will say I feel like it was less exclusive this year because it was like a lot of people there that were just like, you know, kind of regular, normal people. It was super dope that P like, you know, rented out the whole Fox Theater and was letting everybody like just enjoy themselves and have a good time. Like the food was free, um, the drinks were free and, you know, everything and just letting people get that luxury experience i do feel like next year though he's probably gonna make it more exclusive because people were like fighting y'all i didn't see anyone fighting but like the next day when i got online and was looking like at different people post that i you know follow that were there i saw people uploading that people were fighting and i'm like not that y'all is fighting at somebody's birthday party like this man then rented this place out for y'all to have a good old time and y'all up in here fighting on his birthday. Like, very disrespectful. I will say it took me like two hours to literally get in there. And then once I got in there, I was like literally waiting the rest of the night because it was so many people. I probably waited like 30 minutes at the bar. I probably spent like 30 minutes in the line at the photo booth because people like literally kept butting and getting in front of people and it was just it was crazy but i really 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 had such a good time um and i'm happy that i was able to experience this i got to meet you know some people added some people on my socials to got to network and just overall just have a good time like i really needed a night out and i feel like that was just like the perfect night out like i looked good i felt good and i had a great time y'all like i'm trying to be outside okay i'm trying to be outside this summer lol but yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog okay i'm trying to put some honey on her and i'm out of honey so i'm trying to like squeeze it out excuse the noise y'all but i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog um make sure that you guys like comment and subscribe always remember that commenting on my video helps my channel and helps you know me get put it helps me get pushed out more um you know tell me what you guys think just make sure that y'all like comment and subscribe but yeah um i will see you guys thursday big things are happening oh almost fell Big things are happening, y'all. Um, I don't know if I want to wait to say this in my next video, but I think I'm going to say it now because I'm really, really excited. So if you guys follow me on TikTok, you know that on my TikTok, I always talk about my shows and y'all know that I'm a die hard power fan. So I pretty much go viral on TikTok um, and I did like my little last review about Power Book 2 Season 3. And during that time, um, one of the cast members from Power um, Publicist ended up finding me on TikTok. So, your girl will be talking to a cast member from Power Book 2 about season three. Now, I know it's been like a little minute since the show has went off, but I've been working on this probably for about maybe four weeks um 
it's been a minute since I've been working on this, but I'm just so happy that this is coming to, you know, fruitation and, th and this is happening, you know, because they literally like found me and I was like, oh, hold up, let, 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 let's set something up. You know what I'm saying? So I'm really, really, really excited. Um, I can't wait for you guys to see what we talk about. And I just wanted to let y'all know, like, never give up on yourself. Never sleep on yourself. Keep going, keep going, keep going, because you don't know who's watching and, you know, who may come across your content and like it. And me doing stuff like that has worked, like, so far in my career. So I'm going to keep going. And I want y'all to keep, keep going and never give up on yourself. Always remember that you can do anything um, and you know, you have the power to change your life. So yeah, good things are happening, y'all. I love y'all. Thank you for supporting me always. Subscribe, comment, and like, and I will see you guys Thursday. I'm aiming to be more consistent. I know I say this all the time, but it's hard, but I'm done making excuses. Like I gotta come hard with my platform. So yeah, make sure that y'all like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys Thursday. Love y'all.